Humboldt H-3212 three-wheel polishing device is designed to simulate the polishing effects of traffic on asphalt pavement. Polishing of unbound aggregates per Ashto PP103 and asphalt mixtures per Ashto PP104 can be accomplished. The 60 by 42 by 6 inch deep stainless steel water tank should be placed on a level floor. A drain hole and overflow drain plug are located on the front side of the water tank and should have access to a floor drain. Place the entire three-wheel polishing device inside the water tank. Position the back actuator in the mounting bracket with the cylinder side of the actuator facing the back side of the machine and the reverse for the front actuator. Then slide the supplied quick connect pin through the aligned holes. Now you will need to level the unit by adjusting the feet. Using a 3 quarter inch wrench, adjust the nuts of the four leveling feet below the staging area. Using an 11 16 inch wrench, adjust the leveling feet below the testing area. The bottom nut raises and lowers the feet, the top nut tightens it in place. Connect the supplied water tube to the Y fitting on the water pump. Connect the water hose to the left and right sprayer. Left and right sprayers and water pump apply a uniform water supply across the sample to wash off abraded rubber particles. Connect the proximity sensor male connector to the three pin female connector. Connect the vacuum pump three prong plug to the female plug. Connect the power supply cable to the power module. Connect power supply cable to the 115 volt 60 hertz external supply. Now that you have power, you must connect the actuators to the wheelbase. Press the black button on the control panel to lower electronic actuators into the opening of the wheelbase hinges. Use the provided quick release pins to secure electronic actuators onto the wheelbase hinges. Press the white up button on the control panel to lift the wheelbase assembly. The maximum wheelbase clearance is 6 inches. The 27 by 26 inch staging area eases the installation and removal of the molds in the testing area and enables testing with the dynamic friction tester before and after polishing the sample. Four-sided acrylic panels prevent water from spraying outside of the testing area and, as a safety measure, containing sample debris within the testing area. The front door opens outward 180 degrees, staying clear and out of the way during pre-testing functions. The front locking hinges secure the door from falling or opening. The plastic sample platform allows the sample holder to slide in and out of the testing area with ease. The wheelbase can be removed for service using an Allen wrench. Place the sample holder on the white plastic platform. Then, using the handles, slide the platform from the testing area into the staging area. Make sure that the white plastic sample platform touches the very back of the testing area. Use the adjustment knobs on each side of the three-wheel polishing device to center and secure the sample holder into place. Press the black down button on the controller to lower the wheelbase onto the sample. Once the wheels have made sufficient contact with the sample, remove the quick release pins from the left and right electronic actuators. Place the quick release pins into the holder while not in use for safekeeping. Press the white up button on the controller to raise the electronic actuators. It is essential that the electronic actuators are raised to their upper limit to avoid contact with the wheelbase during rotation. Turn the door hinges located on each side counterclockwise to unlock and lower the door. Verify the door is in contact with a security switch. An improperly mounted or loose security switch will prevent wheel rotation. Turn the door hinges clockwise to lock the door in place. Press the reset button to set the count to 100,000 revolutions. The number of rotations can be adjusted if 100,000 is not needed. Switch the pump toggle to the on or off position. In case of emergency, push the emergency stop button. To disable the emergency stop, twist and pull. Press the green button to initiate the test. The counter will start counting down from 100,000 revolutions until it reaches zero. A sensor located at the back tracks each full rotation. The H-3212 has been programmed at the factory to run at 60 RPM. The VFD located inside the control box can be adjusted before a test to run slower or faster. Just use the up or down arrows. 
The H-3212 three-wheel polishing device is another great Humboldt solution to your testing needs. And with its convenient staging area, you can perform your dynamic friction tests and sample polishing with ease.